Hey guys, I welcome you all to my YouTube channel Gardening Paradise and hope you all would be doing great. So in this video, I'm going to talk about how to grow fenugreek very easily on your roof or balcony. Before going further, a small request to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get the notification about my new videos. First of all, let's discuss about the germination requirement of these seeds. So the ideal temperature range for germination is in between 7 to 23 degrees Celsius or 45 to 75 degree Fahrenheit. Or if I talk about the specific temperature, so the optimum one is 21 degrees Celsius or 70 degree Fahrenheit. So these seeds do not need light in order to germinate. So you can cover them with a thin layer of soil, but uh, don't bury them too deep. These seeds will take 7 to 14 days to germinate at the ideal temperature range. But sometime can take up to 3 weeks to germinate if the soil is little colder or warmer than the ideal temperature range. I'm going to use this plastic tub to grow fenugreek. You can grow it in any kind or size of container depending upon uh, the quantity you consume. Let's drill some holes at the bottom for drainage. As far as potting mix is concerned, fenugreek can be grown in any kind of soil provided it has good drainage and decent amount of organic matter. Here I am reusing potting mix prepared last season, but you cannot just directly reuse it. You have to treat it first and I have already documented the whole process. Uh, you may check that video. Link would be there on the screen and in the description as well. I have filled the soil in the tub. Now just water it thoroughly and let it sit overnight to let the mix settle down and absorb the water. I have already prepared this tub by watering it yesterday only. Uh, soil has settled down. Now with the help of any tool just till the upper layer of the mix. These are the fenugreek seeds. This pack costed me just rupees 10. If you want, you can also purchase these and lots of other seeds online at a very low price. I have already made a video regarding this. So we'll share the details of that video and the seller in the description. Now just spread the seeds on the mix. Cover the seeds slightly with the mix. Spread the seeds 
spray some water. I'm planting these seeds in late October. Uh, it's a start of winter here. So I'll keep this tub in open under direct sunlight. But if you're planting these seeds a little early, then depending upon the climate at your place, you may keep the pot in semi-shaded location as well. The important point is to always keep the potting mix moist. This is the result after 10 days. Most of the seeds have sprouted. This is after 7 more days, true leaves have started to emerge, now these plants can be feeded. I'll be using a homemade liquid fertilizer to feed it now. If you want to know the process of preparing the liquid fertilizer, please check in the description, link of the video I've already made about the same is given there. All the plants are growing great can be harvested now. So I'll just cut them. I've harvested the leaves. This is the produce I've collected. All these plants will regrow for another harvest. This is after another 15 days of last harvest. You can see the new growth. And I've just harvested half of the leaves this time. Hoping to get 3 to 4 more harvests this season. I hope you must have enjoyed this video. Please hit the like button. Share this video to as many people as you can with. Do write your comments if you have any. Thanks for watching. Happy gardening.